goodness, I had the craziest, most crazy, awesome, awesome, crazy psycho, psycho, crazy, psychosomatic. I don't even know what that means. I had the weirdest dream. First of all, dream starts out, I'm sitting on top of my friend's refrigerator. Why I'm sitting on top of the refrigerator? I have no idea whatsoever. And I see my friend and I'm like, hey, oh my goodness, I haven't seen you in forever. Let's hang out. We can't hang out. I have stuff to do. What could you possibly have to do? I have to help Dave get to the magic potion so that we can save all of mankind. I would love to help you save all of mankind. Well, there's this potion. It's called Hell Juice, and only Dave can drink it. And if Dave drinks the Hell Juice, everybody lives forever. Why can't I drink the Hell Juice? I'll drink it. I will help us all live forever. You can't drink the Hell Juice. Only Dave can drink the Hell Juice. Otherwise, we all die. And if Dave drinks the Hell Juice, we all live forever. 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 First, we have to make sure we find it before the Kung Fu Asian finds. It. Apparently I get very racist in my dreams. That or his name really was Kung Fu Asian, I'm not sure. So then we're running. We're all running in place. We're just going fruitlessly. Bam! There it was. The hell juice sitting there. And I reached out to grasp it really quick before the Kung Fu Asian could. And that's when I realized that I am the Kung Fu Asian. And despite the fact that I desperately want to give the potion to Dave to save all of mankind, I feel this overwhelming desire and urge to drink the potion myself because I am the Kung Fu Asian. So I drank the potion, and as I drank the potion, all these voices started swirling around my head, and they're like, you drink the hell potion and you're dying. Ah. Yeah, that was my dream. And so I awoke from my dream thinking to myself, oh my, what the F did I just dream about? I don't understand. Oh my gosh, look at this. I found a pine cone, the perfect pine cone. If there was a movie made about a pine cone and they had to have a perfect pine cone to play the starring role, this would be the pine cone they would use because it's amazing. Look at how perfectly perfect this pine cone is. I fell asleep last night at 10 o'clock, but unfortunately, I woke up at midnight. Perfect, two hour night sleep, oh my gosh. So I did what any normal person my age does. I knit a hot pink scarf. I have a hot pink scarf now. I live in Florida, so I don't really need a hot pink scarf, but in the off chance that it gets cold, I got one. That's right. I bet you that this could not only be a scarf, but it could also be like a headband. For reals, I love you guys. Yeah. Ah! Oh my goodness, I almost forgot to tell you that I now have a Twitter. I will put the link in the sidebar. Now you can stalk me.